You're on, you're on the vlog. I am squishing up avocados for Max to try his first food besides milk. They say they start with rice milk, but my mom always started with like avocados and stuff. So I'm gonna do that. Buddy! Buddy, look. Look, Max. It's yourself. Say hi, myself. Say hi, myself. Look, <laughs> sweetie. Here. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> oh, he smiles. That weird. <laughs> His first time ever tasting something besides milk. <laughs> he doesn't really know what to do with it. Keep it in there. <laughs> this is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Good job! Oh, oh! Oh you no! Okay? Oh no! Oh, oh yeah, he's okay. You okay, buddy? He's just not used to. You're okay. Did okay? I wanted to wait to feed him until he was six months old, and that's today. But he wants more. Look, he's weak. Go. This little boy. This little. <laughs> He's like, I'm not sure. I'm so proud. It's a proud mommy moment. Huh. You did so good. You got avocado everywhere. What did you do? He just ate his first solid. What was it? Avocado. Oh, did he like it? Kind of. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, and then he'd be like, <coughs> but then he'd like eat it. <laughs> it was really cute. Yeah. Can you it? Yes. Hi, Terry. <laughs> Hi. You're on. You're on the vlog. So lovely. Subscribe. <laughs>
Yeah, yeah we got bananas. Cause that's gonna be next on baby list. He's gonna try bananas next, and I think oh, I think he'll like them a little bit more than he liked the avocados because avocados they're kind of an acquired taste. This is how much he liked avocados. Oh, and we got sweet potatoes at Walmart because I'm gonna. That's gonna be on the list for baby food too, because I want to try and make my own baby food for a while. We'll see how long that lasts. We're at in and out right now. I know, I know. We, I ran today and I'm like, first first time running, I'm like, I need to reward myself. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> no, we're just like super hungry. We haven't had in and out in forever, so we're getting it. Don't judge. And then we're gonna go to Old Navy and get him some clothes. And then. Buddy. And then we're gonna go to my brother's house, Aaron's house. I don't think I've ever vlogged there, so. Um, I mean, you guys have met Aaron and his family, but I don't think I've ever vlogged at his house. So, um, cause he just got a new dog today. So we're gonna go meet the little cutie and hopefully he licks my face. to my brothers well we were almost to my brothers and max started falling asleep so we drove around the neighborhood for until he fell asleep and so now we're about to go in and meet the new puppy <laughs> You so many things, huh? Say hi. I have to take him for a walk up the every day after school. About two years this, this dog is adorable, and I think I think Bentley's not gonna know what to do with him. But they got him a toy, and already and found the squeaker in it. The, he decapitated it. Look at the look at the murder scene. He's chewing chewing up the squeaker. Blood and guts everywhere. <laughs> Sarah was so excited, huh, Sarah? So did you not know about it until today? Until I got home from school. Really? This was a surprise for you today? Mm -hmm. Tell him, tell the story of how you met him. So I came home from school and helped my mom carry the groceries in. Mm -hmm. And my mom said that she had a surprise, an uh, early birthday present. And she said that it would be easy for me to notice what it was because it was big. Mm -hmm. And then I came inside and saw it. And how did you feel? I was so excited. So exactly. cute. <laughs> Here he is. He's so... The fact that he's letting her get on top of her like that, and, that's huge. And what does that, that mean, Tessa? That means... <laughs> I'm, I'm the... I'm the dog expert here because he was letting her he was laying on his back and he was letting her get on top of him that's a really good thing because that means that he he like he doesn't feel like he needs to dominate like he he's like very secure with people so that's really good yeah
and I can't get in. Help! Love me some Old Navy. I go to the clearance section and I've gotten stuff for, one time I got a sh some shirts for 47 cents. Okay, we're going back to the baby section. Okay, let's look at the baby stuff. A big problem that I've come to find out with having a baby boy is there is no, there's like hardly any baby boy clothes. Like look how many girl clothes there are. All girl, all over there. It's so fun to dress up a little human. <laughs> I get to put them in whatever I want. And it's hard to find cute stuff. The snuggle is real. That is, that's adorable. Cause I say that all the time. The struggle, the struggle's real. Legacies, family, when you see them like a family. 